Hi everyone and welcome to another little video by Nitro Cosplay. Today I'm going to be looking at Flexi Paint Clear. Um, someone asked me the other day, what is Flexi Paint Clear? What do you do with it? What's the point of it? So I'm just going to go through quickly a few little things that you can do with the Flexi Paint Clear and I hope that that will clear some things up for you all. Okay, so in front of me I've got quite a selection of bits and pieces. We'll start off by taking a look at the Flexi Paint Clear Bottle. Um, comes in different sizes, this is their 500 gram bottle. Um, as you can see it's actually white in colour, um, but I, it, it dries completely clear. Um, this has had a couple of coats now of the Flexi Paint Clear, and you can see that it still looks like just your normal piece of EVA foam it's got no colour to it at all um, no cracks no creases and the idea behind sealing your foam with the clear is you can then go ahead and apply acrylics on top of that or you can use um, a spray can on top of it you can airbrush straight on top of it and that will the paint will actually adhere to that flexi paint clear because it's got a slight tack to it so it's really good if you just want to seal your paint and then uh, seal your prop, sorry, and then go ahead and apply anything, any paint colours that you want, for example. Um, the other thing you can do with it is you can mix in acrylic colours to the Flexi Paint Clear. Um, they also sell pigments you can mix into the Flexi Paint Clear as well, and say so that's been painted on there. And that's now dry and again no cracks no creases and the final thing that you know that I that I can come up with that you can do with it is to um, actually seal your props afterwards so this is a gauntlet from my Gears of War cosplay uh, it was painted with flexi paint it was then weathered with um, normal acrylics got nice blood splatters on there and then you can go ahead and use the flexi paint clear paint over the whole the whole piece uh, wait for it to dry apply the silicone oil to remove the tack and your paintwork is now completely protected and the piece remains completely flexible with no cracks or creases or anything like that so that's another thing that you can do with the um, clear so in front of me here I've got a little pot I'm just going to show you um, quickly so as I say it comes out white in colour just get your normal paintbrush or if you want to dilute it and airbrush with it you can so just paint it on as you would with um, normal paints just put a little bit on there and so that's how it's going to look when you first apply it to the piece and that is how it will dry completely clear um, so flexi paint cell pigments I don't currently have any otherwise I would show you that um, so instead I'm just going to apply a tiny little bit of um, airbrush acrylic you can use normal tubed acrylic just give it a mix in there like that It'd be exactly the same with the pigments. With the pigments you need to add a little bit of water to make a paste first um, and then um, mix it in with your flex paint clear. Just going to put a bit on my brush. Get that same scrap piece of foam there just to show you. And that is how it dries so because it's clear obviously the white color will come out of it as it dries that's wet and then that's the dry again that's wet and that's dry completely flexible 
so that's the three things that um, say so I know that you can do with the flexi paint clear you can use it as a um, base coat to seal your foam before you apply any acrylics you can mix in uh, acrylic paints or pigments and then paint it onto your piece or as we saw with the gauntlet you can use it as a top coat to protect your weathering and your um, paint details that you've put in and then just apply the silicon oil afterwards just to remove that tack um, and that is it there's you know it's nice and simple nice and easy stuff so there we have it guys that is the flexi paint clear that is the applications that you can do with it um, if you're not using flexi paint whether it be the clear or any of their color ranges uh, I highly recommend it as I'm sure you all know by now I absolutely love the product um, it's strong bonding durable uh, super flexible as you've seen uh, it's got no toxins or chemicals in there that are dangerous you know for you or your health uh, it's latex free which is absolutely ideal because my wife's got a latex allergy and just before I go that was the piece that I painted during the video that's now actually dry um, and you can see you've got the um, copper section and you've got the clear section there's only one coat I've put on there um, and you can see completely flexible there's no cracks and there's no creases in that and so that's just a single coat so really good stuff and um, that's all for today's little video there on the flexi paint clear so keep it nitro cosplay for more tips tricks and tutorials to come